everybody now talks about uh, obesity overweight and uh, body mass index so we need to know what exactly is the body mass index the simplest way of calculating ideal weight is to take the height in centimeters and to minus it with 100 for example if somebody is 170 centimeters in height and uh, the ideal weight will be 70 kilograms because 100 centimeters has to be taken away. Why we are so concerned about overweight and obesity are obesity is a silent killer. It leads to several other problems called there we call them as comorbidities. The top in the list of comorbidities is diabetes type 2 diabetes and the followed by hypertension which is high blood pressure followed by knee joint pains followed by infertility in girls the other problem being sleep apnea. People who are heavy, they won't be able to sleep properly, and that's called sleep apnea. And the other important thing is, people who are heavy, they are prone to some particular malignancies, they are cancers, especially cancer of the breast, cancer of the uterus, and cancer of large bowel. In obesity, there are no specific genetic causes are seen actually. People think that a lot of genetic factors are involved. But in the same family, a mother and child or a father and child, they are obese because they have similar eating habits. It's not the genetics. Commonly why we are seeing obesity nowadays is very sedentary lifestyle, the kind of work what we are doing, unable to go out much and uh, eating very western kind of diet and very calorie studded diet uh, added to the sedentary living. So the, in simpler terms, putting more calories into the body and unable to consume the calories what we are uh, taking in. That is what is leading to the imbalance actually of the calories and slowly over a period of time people are tending to gaining weight like 4 to 5 kilos without knowingly each year people gain weight. People think that it's uh, hormonal changes which increases weight and obesity but it's uh, other way around is true actually increased weight and obesity they cause hypothyroidism as well as polycystic ovaries which is popularly known as PCOD in young girls which leads to infertility. Obesity leads to many comorbidities and hormonal imbalances and if it crosses more than 25 kilos of excess weight people they may need to go for this weight reduction or bariatric surgery. It's done laparoscopically with, a, with a very small cuts on the abdomen and people recover very fast and uh, the kinds of bariatric surgery what are done very commonly in our country majority of it's called sleeve gastrectomy the other surgery is called gastric bypass. They are done very safely and people come down in weight over a period of time from 6 months to 9 months they come close to their ideal weight. Let's fight against obesity and make our nation slim and healthy.